What's up guys, Aida Bice Help here, and today Apple released iOS 10.1 Beta 2 to registered developers. You can go ahead and download it over the air right now. Uh, no software updates yet for the public beta testers. Right now the new build number for developer is 14B67. That's going to be the new beta. On the left here I have an iPhone running iOS 10.1 Beta 1. We're going to go through some of the changes. As you can see there, it's prompted me for the Beta 2 update. But we're going to go see some of the changes. There's some minor changes in between the softwares. Uh, nothing drastic, but I first wanted to share with you guys some of the Geekbench scores here on the latest beta. The top one would be iOS 10.1 and beta 1 coming in at 3471 and 5605 on the multi-core score. And as you can see there, the beta 2 right below it is 3472, which is slightly above, nothing drastic. And the multi-core score would be 5629. Again, no drastic changes there in terms of the performance on the device when it comes to these two betas. But inside of messages, we can find a small change. As the most talked about for this beta is very, very minor. Let's go here into these uh, stickers that you can send. You see that at the bottom here on beta 1, we have those dots. So we have the dots right there to scroll through all of these stickers that we have available. On the new beta, we have a slider. See that new slider there? It's just a new slider, something minor, but that is a change with the new beta 2 on iOS 10.1. Now, an interesting thing that I noticed, if you take a look here, I'm going to see if you guys can tell the difference when I go ahead and 3D touch on a folder. Can you see the difference? Okay, so on the left here, beta 1, you see that the icons are on the left side of the text. On the beta 2, they're on the right side of the text. And that's the same on beta 1, but it's just interesting that depending on where the icon is on the screen, so if it's on the right side of the screen, the icons show up on the right. And I can show you that here in settings as well. Let me go ahead and 3D touch here in settings. See that? So this one's on the right, so all the icons are on the right. This one's on the left of the screen, so all the icons are on the left of the text. Minor changes again, guys, nothing drastic. Everything else seems to be flowing as expected. We still haven't seen Apple drop any dark mode yet. I know a lot of you guys are waiting. I'm waiting myself. No dark mode available right now as of yet with the latest beta of iOS 10.1. No new wallpapers, unfortunately, guys. I know a lot of you guys were waiting for the new wallpapers. Take a look here at beta 1 and beta 2 for iOS 10.1. See the same wallpapers. Nothing, nothing has really changed. It really sucks. I really wanted new wallpapers with iOS 10 for whatever reason. It just gives the OS a fresher look. It's something that's different to other OS's but this time around Apple didn't really add much other than the green standard iOS 10 wallpaper that you see there. But all in all guys those are some of the minor changes. If I discover any additional changes I'll update you guys with a follow up video. This was just a very quick look at some of the performance and some of the minor changes of iOS 10.1. If you enjoyed the video like always don't forget to leave a like. Much more videos coming your way. Stay tuned. It's been Ida Help and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.